guys welcome back to the channel guys okay so what it seems like you know just a while for you guys okay it has been uh, about a year plus okay after our last IVF okay so right now as you can see the background is different okay, because we have already moved into our new house and we have something to announce Esther you got something to announce yeah so we have a good news to announce right yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah so where shall we start hmm. yeah. so okay uh, what happened was okay uh, after for those of you who have seen all these episodes okay we've gone through a few IVFs and all this uh, a lot of ups and downs okay for sure the journey is not that simple emotional yeah emotional physical and the time yep so yeah and all this and some of the money also yeah so okay so right now okay uh, it has been a, a while already and the good news we're going to share is okay yesterday uh you know all the know we're still you know trying for a baby and all this we are still working hard and yesterday uh something happened Okay, this is not a COVID test kit. Let me just tap on this. Yep, so this happened and... We were skeptical. <laughs> yeah, because... We are like... Because we've been like cheated many times. Uh, I think for couples that are trying for a baby, you probably can know. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, a lot of times we try, right? It's always negative, negative. And sometimes it's like... You know, uh, invalid. Yeah, it's not positive. It's invalid. So you're like, you know, you're curious, and then you go down to you know a, a, a store and you just buy one more, and you go and test. You know, and then it's negative again. Yeah. So this time round, okay, we got this. Okay, we got this, and we are like, you know, uh, how should we feel? Maybe it should be you know, error, error la, or invalid la. Yeah. So the next morning, okay, uh, Esther tried again, and she got this. Yeah, this one is the expensive kit. Yeah, I'm not sure if you can see this. So we got this this morning. Yeah, and honestly, we are still skeptical. <laughs> yeah. We are trying to manage our own expectation. Yeah, so uh test kits are about 99%, you know, accuracy. The first one is 99%, the second one, I mean if you Roughly know how to count, right? It's not already 99 already because 99% and then 99% again. Yeah, but then, okay, uh, I think Esther is about 5 to 6 weeks pregnant now. Yeah, and uh, we're not going to tell anyone, <laughs> okay, because uh, I think you have to wait it's a few a months. <laughs> yeah, you have to wait like the first trimester or something. Yeah, we've been reading a bit about all this. Yeah, and we will be, you know, uh, keeping a lookout. Yeah, of all the do's and don'ts and all this and we just moved into the new house so there will be some you know drilling and all this we are not sure if we will be superstitious or you know we just get Esther out of the house then I just do some of the the, the reno and all this yeah so uh, just an update guys okay uh, we thank are you. very excited yeah thank you for sticking yeah. with us for so long <laughs> yeah so let's hope you know uh, everything goes smooth yeah, yeah. yeah. Right now, because five to six weeks, right? It is still anything can happen. <laughs> yeah, anything can happen. So let's just wish us luck and stay tuned on the next episode, which is in a few weeks time. All right. So like and subscribe, guys. See you. Bye bye.